Chantai PJ here, checking in. Um, a couple of weeks ago, two, three weeks ago, I put up a video of me flying up to Sendai again, this time to see the show, The Ice, uh, Asada Mao's uh, show. Wonderful show, saw it in Osaka, saw it again in Sendai. Um, while I was up there, I took some videos of uh, me eating various gyutong dishes. Gyutong is beef tongue, uh, which uh, became... I mean, they didn't invent it. Who, who invents tongue, right? That, that's a cow invented tongue. Um, uh, but I mean, in terms of a delicacy here in Japan, I believe it or it originated in Sendai. In any case, um, whenever I'm up there, I always uh, go to a couple of uh, different restaurants that I like that serve different types of gyu tongue. And I'll show you some videos of that uh, coming up here in just a bit. Um, there's also, uh, I wanted to show you a video of, of me eating Sendai beef, which is a particularly expensive but very delicious uh, type of cattle he raised in Japan. Anyway, it was really, really good. Uh, I loved it. Uh, but unfortunately, um, I deleted that video. <laughs> so, uh, but I do have uh, videos of uh, just short clips to show you from my trip in Sendai. Um, if you're interested in the skating part, uh, check the link uh, somewhere here in the video. Or uh, just go back to the previous video, um, and that talks about uh, my review of The Ice, which was a superb show. Anyway, uh, summer's coming to an end. It's uh, September, early September, mid-September, and university starts uh, this coming week, and I'm going back to classes, uh, both as a student and as a teacher, so it'll be a busy, busy semester for me. Anyway, Concept PJ, checking in. Enjoy these clips. In the hotel, I'm going to go out and eat... Uh, one of my favorite restaurants, the DQ. Uh, really, really good Sendai beef and tongue and, and, and other Sendai specialties. So I'm gonna eat there and then go out and have a few drinks. Yeah. Uh, the Ice Sendai was a wonderful show and um, I just love this town. This is a great town. Although it feels like kind of like cheating to go to an ice show in Sendai and Hanyu is not there. <laughs> but anyway, I love this town. Um, it reminds me when I first moved to Japan, I, I, I lived in Himeji. And these are what I call Inaka cities. They're cities, but they are still small enough geographically and population-wise that people are very polite. It's easy to get around. Um, it's nice. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love my Osaka. But Osaka is a hardcore big city, uh, like Tokyo, New York, uh, London, you know. And they're fun, but they're intense. And there's something a little bit more relaxed, more enjoyable, a little bit more innocent, more pure in a city like Sendai. Um, and I and I like it very much. So uh, plus any any town that's a whiskey town. Although I'm drinking Santori, should be drinking Nika. <laughs> what can you do? It's a convenience store drink. Nine percent, and it's like water. <laughs> Kansai PJ checking in in Sendai uh, next to one of my favorite uh, restaurants, uh, Gyutung Rikyu. It's a chain restaurant, but it's really, really good. Uh, great Gyutung everything sausages, uh, fried, uh, nama, um, tataki, whatever you want. Uh, Gyutung is wonderful here. So there are several restaurants uh, in the uh, Miyagi area, in, in Sendai in particular. So please check it out. Uh, Yutang DQ. Kante PJ checking out. By the way, it's cool tonight. I don't know if you can tell. It's been hot the last uh, day and a half that I've been in Sendai, but it's finally cooling down. And I'm going to go out and have a few whiskeys, because that's what PJ does.
Good stuff.